Well, this is the Assembly Inn in Bath. It's a typical city centre bar. And at the moment, the way the legislation stands, if they wanted to have live music or even have a piano over there in the corner, they'd have to pay for a licence. Well, when the new legislation becomes law, that won't be the case. And with me is the bar's owner, Alan Morgan. How much is this going to help you? Well, at the moment, if we want a licence for live music, we have to apply for a temporary event notice, which is a 10. It costs over £20 and it takes weeks to go through. What will happen in the future? In the future, we can, if you're a venue with less than 200 people, you can have live music in your outlet. That's going to be a help to you as the owner, but is it going to be a help to your residents who might turn around, to, to the local residents who might turn around and say, too noisy? Well, no, we, we obviously get on very well with our neighbours and we wouldn't want to upset our neighbours and we are licensed and we've got a business to run, so we're not going to be stupid. Well, earlier I spoke to Don Foster, Bath's MP, and he explained how this might help some pubs who are at present struggling. What this legislation does is it removes the need to have an entertainment licence under very specific conditions so pubs and clubs can get on and provide it for our entertainment and there are additional protections so that neighbours are not going to lose out. So under this new legislation, bars like this could soon have a piano in the corner and, if they want, live music every evening.